Jo J. Welcome back to the channel, man. You already know what time it is, man. It's your boy back it again with another banger. Yeah? So, for those y'all may know or may not know, my name is Vic. I own a few little cars. I got my 350C, which we're working on on the white body. Uh, also, we got this bad boy today that that's what we're gonna be working on on this video. This project has been way overdue. Not gonna lie. Uh, Should have been did this probably about a year ago or so. But, you know, I've been dealing with a lot of stuff uh, going on with the property we buy and all this other shit. Today, either way, we already got the other side. So the reason why I have in mind the other side is because when I got this fender flare from a homie, shout out to him, man, in Florida, man. That was my dog, bro. That's one, that's one person I meet from out there. Um, this was already cut out. These fenders have these edges right here, which is what, you know, makes it wider on the rear. If you look down here, front looks perfect, but the rear is on like about like two inches. I don't want to go to stay. And the reason why is because I want this rear ones a little bit wider. Obviously, we want to make sure that the door is fully functional. You know what I'm saying? We still got to get, oh, we got the seats for these right here. We got to replace the seats. Just a mess. We got a whole bunch of stuff still in these cars. Uh, I'm debating whether we're gonna run the blue seeds on there or we're gonna get some new ones. So y'all, let's get to it. Let's get to work. Let's get this done because we do have a lot to do. Uh we still gotta get the parts we need for this. We still gotta um get the uh panel bonding for this car. We still got hella fiberglass to work to do. It's a lot. So and excuse the mess in here. I'll be trying to clean every time I clean, I make more mess. Don't know how to keep this shit clean, but it is what it is. I still haven't cut it or anything like that, but let me go ahead and show y'all. So obviously this fender gotta be changed. So we are changing the fender or I'm not sure yet. Uh, the reason why it's so out of here up is because it's heating somewhere here. Everything, I'm gonna just go ahead and uh, do every single other fender first. And the last one is gonna be the one on that side. And the reason why is that is because clearly you can see how this fender is. Let me go ahead and show y'all. You see what I'm saying? So this fan is already toast. So really no point for us to even worry about it, waste our time with it. Everything else, actually I'm gonna start cutting all around. Uh, that way we can kind of have a, like, you know, an idea of what we're doing. Parts to the C. Let me go ahead and show y'all. Um, so I actually cut it uh, pretty small. This one will be tack welded. I'm not even gonna lie because I um, want to make sure this one is more intact. Not sure if I want to open this side a little more wider or not yet. Not sure. In the meantime, we're gonna leave it just like that and. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and put this side back on. Um, I do gotta order some coilovers for this car. So once we order the coilover, we'll test fit well, whichever wheels I got here. Ain't no going back. Well, I look crazy, they look crazy, but ain't no going back, y'all. She is gone, finito. So same as the front, um, definitely no going back. We already did the damage. Now we gotta finish the project, <laughs> bruh. But she's gonna look really good, y'all. So don't go anywhere. Enough to do to mold one side. I think I might have enough uh, body uh, pan, uh, panel bonding. I'm not sure yet. If I don't, then you know we gotta order one. So, but other than that, we're gonna do that. We're gonna go make the other side, put it on, and see how it looks. white body kit on uh 
customize it and use those types of mold and go ahead and make it out of fiberglass. And the reason why I say that is because in the rear, to me, honestly, it's not wide enough. I don't like the way it looks personally. It doesn't look as bad, but obviously you can tell it's not wide enough, at least for my liking. So if you look from the rear, it looks pretty okay. It don't look as bad. Back here, y'all, go ahead and hit the like button. Go down in the comments below. Tell me what you think. Should we leave it like that? The more wider. Either way, hit the like button. Go down in the comments. Tell me what you think. That way we can figure it out. We can fix it and we can make it work. In the meantime, my idea is to make it out of fiberglass. But if you can change my mind, go down in the comments below. Let me know. All right here, you can tell I uh, ended up cutting the mold where the uh where that's gonna come when where that's come uh the gas cap comes in obviously we got to refiber glasses molded to to the necessity of it um this part right here uh that's supposed to go in we got to figure out how we're going to do that but again like i was saying the reason why i'm not too bothered is because i came to the conclusion that we have to uh we have to just use these as a mall definitely gonna use some spacers either way uh, the bow pattern is a little different in here this are 120 the blue is a 120 and the car itself is 112 so gonna need we definitely need some spacers we all the way in there barely see them jokers but man they look good we will leave the video right here simple reason why because we got to order fiberglass uh, we got to get the battery panel Bundy we got to get some more because uh, I don't have enough for the whole entire body kit, white body kit. So we got to order some more. And yes, we have to. I uh, still got to figure out a few things that I, that I want to do with the white body. So with that being said, we're going to leave this right here. If you made it this far in the video, go ahead and hit the like button. Go ahead and subscribe. Do all of that. You know what I'm saying? We need every, every single like y'all can give me. I appreciate that. I love y'all and I'll see y'all in the next.